Have you ever heard of games such as Escape from Tarkov, Marauders, The Cycle Frontier, or Hyenas, which are both dead now, The Cycle Frontier and Hyenas, Dark and Darker, Hawked, Star Siege Dead Zone, Ascendant Infinity, or even Hunt Showdown? Maybe even unfinished games such as Beautiful Light, Project Quarantine, Ark Raiders, or Grey Zone Warfare? If not, don't fret, because I'm here to elaborate on what makes an extraction game an extraction game. How's it going, everybody? My name is Magneti. Welcome to The Mothership, your go-to news source for extraction games so that you can stay better than your friends. Get in, get loot, get out. That's what most people think an extraction game is, but it needs to be so much more than that. A true, full-fleshed extraction game has purpose. Purpose. That's why, in my opinion, a real extraction game doesn't even truly exist yet. Tarkov is really a great start, but we definitely need more than just get in, get guns and crap, and complete objectives and get out. Everyone thinks of extraction games differently. Some strongly suggest that if you don't get in, get loot, and get out with said loot, that it is absolutely not an extraction game. Personally, I beg to differ. I say that the basic concept of an extraction game is simply the idea of a battle royale, but with the addition of extracting something. The extraction process of entering an arena and leaving with something is what I deem the basic concept of an extraction shooter. Take Hawked, for example. Hawked is a really good example of this. They have the battle royale style, and it honestly looks even like Fortnite, but you don't extract loot, per se. You extract an artifact, or multiple artifacts, which you can then use on your character load out later on. But the things that could make an even better extraction shooter is in our, the community's hands. Let me know what you think in the comments down below what could really make an extraction game better. I'm going to list some of my criteria. Adding a story mode or even just a story to the game can easily be an incredible addition to literally any extraction game. Giving the player some sustenance. Just give us something to chew on. All right, give us something to unravel or uncover. And if you want the game to have longevity, make it on the latest engine and have a plan for consistent story releases. I'm talking to you, video game developers. Even if this story is something on the simpler side, at least it's something tangible. I mean, even a story that's played out within given tasks would be cool. Like in Tarkov, you get a task and you uncover something that reveals the story. Grey Zone Warfare is kind of looking like they might be doing something like this. Maybe even having multiple stories or a layered story that unravels with tasks like I mentioned, and NPC and or player interactions, maybe even actual player to player interactions. A hideout is honestly the number one most important thing in an extraction shooter, in my personal opinion. Playability of the game outside of the arena is beyond important to me. Having the feeling of accomplishment and being able to relish in my riches within my hideout or even my debts is an awesome hands-on feeling to me. You get to go into this space that is yours and yours alone, or maybe you can even invite friends and just kind of hang out in this area like a miniature hub. Honestly, a hideout should be more than a hub in my opinion as well, making it larger and customizable and personalizable. Person is that a word? Personal? Personable? Person? Anyways, could be a huge key to creating a more more successful extraction game. Having a hideout like the one in The Division, The Division Dark Zone, or The Division Original, I'm not sure which part it's in, but it's awesome. It's something tangible to work towards, gives you a goal, aspirations, you know, gives items meaning because they all have a purpose for either the story or the hideout, and it's absolutely huge. And honestly, I could make an entire tangent going on about giving every individual item a purpose or a meaning because that's a huge fucking scandal going on around extraction games too right now. Not every item seems to have an intention or really has any sort of large value surrounding it. Some items are just kind of like meh. Some items are just for selling or, it, you know, it depends on the extraction game you're playing. Sometimes you don't even get multiple items and you can only extract a certain type of item that only has one purpose. So there needs to be, I think, a little bit more variety in that, but I won't dig too deep into it. I need a goddamn way to know that I am getting somewhere in life within my video game. 
That might seem kind of backwards in life within my video game, but if you haven't noticed by now, let me make it real clear here. Okay, give me levels or skills or something tangible to work with. I want to work towards something and I'm sure you are the exact same way. And this is kind of where Tarkov has performed really, really well in my opinion. Having different skills in the game along with an actual level is really nice. It is a little minuscule, but it is something to see. Now, I want something more. I want more. Is it so much? Is it is it too much to ask for more? I'm thinking RPG, maybe even survival. Give me RPG or survival style mechanics for player progression within an extraction game, and I would quite literally shit a brick for you on the spot. A golden brick, even. I will shit a gold, I will sign a contract right here, right now. I will shit a golden brick. Magneti on YouTube shall shit golden brick if said extraction game is created with RPG or survival elements for player progression. In-game progression is beyond important. I would even go as far to say it is probably one of the most important aspects to every gamer, and that's why we game. To feel that sense of accomplishment or success or achievement or even just having fun getting something done with the bros or the sisses or both sisters bros you know just accomplishing an objective completing it and feeling that satisfaction if you enjoyed the video click subscribe for more content like this keep in mind i am the go-to news source for extraction games so that you can stay better than your friends other than that stick around for more extraction game news We'll talk again real soon. Peace.